Hello, hello, I am Tessie Sanders Madlock or Mrs. Madlock. It's dear time. So come on in, come on in and listen to one of my favorites. That's Aesop's Fables. Yes, we're going to listen to, I was going to say, we're going to hear the lion and the mouse. Do you have your readers? Great. Put them on. Put them on. Come on in. Let me share my screen. So let's take a look. Let me get all of these ads out of here. At our show, The Lion and the Mouse, Aesop's Fables. A lion lay asleep in the forest with his great head resting on his paws. A little mouse came along and ran over his nose, which woke the lion. The angry lion laid his huge paw on the tiny mouse and was about to kill him. Oh, please, begged the poor mouse. If you will let me go, I promise to repay you in some way. The lion laughed. <laughs> at the idea that a little mouse could ever repay him, but he let him go. It happened shortly after that, that the lion was caught by some hunters who tied him with strong ropes to the ground. The mouse hearing the roar came and chewed through the rope with his teeth and set him free. Was I not right? said the little mouse. Little friends may prove to be great friends. Stop and think. What do you think the moral to this story is? I do hope that you've enjoyed dear time I know that I have. I always enjoy dear time. I'm going to stop sharing my screen here. And come back for another dear time next time. Bye-bye for now. I am Miss Tessie Sanders Matlock. Happy reading.